This is a case of an incidental inverted papilloma in an 86-year-old male with a history of low-grade glioma. Centered near the region of the right middle meatus and completely filling the right maxillary antrum, there is a mass which is T1 iso-intense to skeletal muscle, T2 heterogeneously hyper-intense with low ADC values and avid post-contrast enhancement. On the T2-weighted images, the lesion displays curvilinear striations, giving it a convoluted cerebriform appearance. The same pattern is demonstrated on the post-contrast image as the lesion spills into the right nasal cavity through a focal region of dehiscence in the right maxillary antral wall. Inverted papillomas typically arise along the lateral nasal wall, being centered at the middle meatus. The lesion may or may not extend into the right maxillary antrum. A focal region of hyperostosis may be seen at the lesion origin. Differential diagnoses include solitary sinonasal polyp, sinonasal squamous cell carcinoma, or sinonasal polyposis. 10% of inverted papillomas either degenerate into or coexist with a squamous cell carcinoma. The typical patient age is between 40 and 70 years.